fam. It's your boy G Ridge. Hey, it's going down today, fam. You already know it's Mother's Day. And you know when it's Mother's Day, you got to step it up. You got to turn it up. So, wanted some fish for Mother's Day today. You know, I already sent my mom a Mother's Day gift, and she was so excited, fam. Showed up at her front door, so she knows she was excited. I'm also gonna send mix her some fish as well and send her uh, several plates of uh, uh, dinners today. We're having some fish all day, and I got a bunch of it. So I gotta do a lot of frying today. I'm gonna fry outside, so it won't make it hot in the house, cause it is about 88 degrees out here. Duval. Anyway, fam, I hope y'all, all the mothers out there, have a happy Mother's Day, and all the ladies who don't even have mothers, cause I'm pretty sure you've been a mother to somebody. Well, we need women, like we need air to breathe. For real, for real. Anyway, fam, I love y'all to life. You ready? I'm ready. All I'm gonna do is frying fish. You don't see me fry before. I'm gonna put a little fresh yellow mustard on that thing. Yes, sir. I got like uh, pretty much up to like 15 pieces of uh, uh, whole fish, you know, with the tail on and everything. So yeah, and I got some fillets of fish to the side. All right, that's just for extra. It's going down today. Anyway, you just see me fry fish before, but I'm gonna fry it outside. I'm gonna use some vegetable oil today, and I created my own batter. I use um, Louisiana season uh, fish fry. I use uh, a little bit of butt that chicken fish fry. I then I created my own and I mixed it all together. Oh, MG. I added some regular all purpose flour, a tiny little bit of salt, and because you know the season uh, butt that chicken and the fish fry, Louisiana fish fry already have salt in it. Yes, yeah, sir. And I put. Uh, as I say, I put one cup of all-purpose flour and one full cup of yellow stone ground corn meal. I mix it up, add a little salt with it, and it came to perfection. Stick with your boy. All right? You ready? I'm ready. So hold on tight. I'll be right back. Let's get started. Okay, while the oil is getting hot, we're going to take some French's yellow mustard. We're going to go ahead and squirt a little bit in each bag to make sure the inside of that, that fish be nice and juicy. Okay, and then with the batter that we made, the outside gonna be nice and crunchy. No more in this one. All right. Okay. We're gonna take some. I'm gonna let it marinate in the refrigerator for 30 minutes and then we're gonna come back and put the, the batter in there and the oil and we'll be getting the oil ready so it can get hot, okay? It's gonna take some, like so. If we get it in there, drown it in there pretty good. So we want it nice and I'm gonna let that oil get good and hot at 350 degrees, okay? Then we're gonna turn it down once we drop the first wave of fish in there. We're gonna turn it down, all right? Then we're just gonna let it just, you know, fry at a medium pace, all right? All right, fam, here we go. Oh yeah, that, that done coated real good. Look at that, see how that done good? That done coated real good, how it stuck on there? With that mustard and stuff? Yeah, so stick with your boy. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on out there, boy. Yeah, we can fit like three nice sized fish in there. Mm hmm. Ooh. Turn the temperatures down. Other than that, it would have been burnt up. You cannot straighten this tail out without breaking them off. It should be all right. Look at that. It don't even take that long, fam. Once I all get a certain, a certain amount of temperature on it. Okay. 
As you can see, it, you see how it don't calm down? That's absolutely perfect. Yes, sir. Let it calm down. We done been in there for just two minutes. Give it another minute to cook the inside of that fish. So on and so forth. So I'm gonna have like uh, maybe six to seven drops of fish. You do the math. So that take about 35 minutes to finish. 35 to 40 minutes to finish all that fish. Especially when you deep fry it, fam. See, it's slowing down. It's working on the inside of the fish. So we want that fish to be perfect. If you can see how it's floating. Look at that. Oh, MG. <laughs> Mama! There goes that man. That's that look I'm going for, fam. Oh, we. All right, fam, I'm just coming to show you. It's still coming out crispy. Look at that. Oh, MG. Look at the oil, still brown, light brown. That's, that's because I'm not burning it. Look at that. Bam. You see that? One come, one all. I'm not finished. I got another bag to go. All right, fam, these are the last two that's coming out. Oh, wait, another thing of beauty. So the sucker grain, we're going to walk it over here with the rest. Oh, look at that, fam. Bam, laying right on top. Got to be more careful. And that's... Last but not least. Ooh, we Let it drain. Now that's a mountain right there, fam. That is definitely a thing of beauty. We're going in. Oh, MG. Where's the fillets? Hold on, let me show you a couple of fillets that I had. There's one. They're they golden brown. Look at that. They're golden too. They're hiding everywhere. They, they, they got another one. Yes, sir. So it came out, I had 15 pieces of croaker, fam. Okay, 15 pieces of croaker. And uh, four filet of fish. All right, I'll see you inside with the plate up. And there it is. Love y'all to life. G Rich out. Happy Mother's Day. In your mind.